This video will cover the Art Pro Oil Pastels art set that were added in version 16.12 of Twisted Brush Pro Studio. From your shortcuts, uh, select the Art Pro category and go to Art Pro Oil Pastels. You see we have really one brush in this art set and within this br this art set we have uh, modifiers so from this one brush you can uh, quickly create uh, a number of r variations on the base brush uh, changing the oil level, pigment level, and uh, the blend level and I'll show uh, some of the ranges that you can expect to to see uh, by doing those. So selecting that uh, core brush uh, gives some default values for for an oil pastel. Um, I'm using the stylus. The uh, light pressure will end up uh, with a, a textured look and quite a bit of blending. With hard pressure it will uh, cover uh, pretty pretty fully. So that's the the defaults. What I'm going to do here is make a few copies of the uh, base uh, oil pastel brush uh, so I can do some variants of that and um, quickly switch between them. So I'm going to hold down the shift key and click on uh, another shortcut slot. So I've created uh, three copies of the base brush. They're all identical at this point. They're all the base uh, oil pastel brush. What I'll do is go to the uh, second shortcut here and again pop up the uh, brush select dialog and what I'm going to do is uh, change the the settings uh, for this base brush using these modifiers. Within Twisted Brush anytime you see an icon uh, which shows this little gear uh, for a brush that's just a brush modifier that's modifying the brush effect. It's not selecting a new brush for you, it's changing your existing brush and merging those settings in. So I have the base brush selected, but if I go and change the um, or select blend level 5, it's still the base brush, but now it has a, a higher level of blending. So what I'm going to do is select uh, high level blending, oil level of 1, and pigment level of 1. So this is basically saying that for this brush in this slot, the uh, blending is going to be high, pigment level is going to be low, and the oil level is going to be low. And what this will give you if you select a, a light hue, or white in this case, is almost a pure pure blending brush without adding much pigment at all. You will still get a little bit if you go over it and press hard you're still going to get uh, white coming through um, but if you press lightly you're going to do uh, basically blending as if you were burnishing um, the colors that were on your your paper uh, already. So we've you see we've assigned that to brush sort shortcut uh, to we can go back to one and we have our original base uh, oil pastel go back to two and we have our blending. Now you could see that when I went back to two the color uh, was still set to, to this brownish red. If you right click on a shortcut and say edit brush options you can change the name and also tell it to save your your color information. So in this case we've saved the we've changed the name and we told it to say, keep it um, white. So when we go back here to the first brush and select a different color, when we go back to our second shortcut it's going to remember white and blending for us. So those are some of the uh, really quick uh, introduction to the oil pastel uh, blenders.